Support Laneside. Get something cool. and welcome to another edition of Lane Side Reviews. As always, I am the Bearded Beast, Rob Johnson, joined once again by Scoops Porter, and we're going to take it Lane Side to see today's episode. Alright guys, here is Wayne Porter, our speed dominant player. Yeah, he's bowling on Defy House Shot. Now, uh, this ball, we've seen Boop. this before, haven't we, kind of? Kind of, yes. The USBC likes to make rule changes. Yes. So I think when last we saw this ball, it was around 2.45 RG, which wouldn't be legal anymore, correct? No. So we have the new modified... Contortion? Contortion symmetrical core. Can't these companies come up with names that are easier to say? <laughs> They just do it to torture me now, I think. I they think so. They're like, watch the video. I'm like, ha, 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 ha. Um, <laughs> no, it's got the aggression solid CFI, so that's carbon, fiber, fiber and, and fuse. fuse. That's the snow tires. Stars. Yeah, and this one's at 500, 2,000 out of box. Yeah, so that's the maximum mid lane yeah. read, and, and you can oh, see it. yeah. So so we were talking about this core, the low RG. Yes. What did they do? Uh, I think they just – they changed the shape a little bit and just modified it so it's basically yeah. the same core it's they've the just same core they just tweaked it enough to get it to within get, the rules get it within the rules now i know this ball did uh, i'm a brunswick guy yeah. but i know uh having watched the tour this ball did very well in yeah. its heyday yeah um i think there was this the, the sauce yeah without the uh-huh and then there was the hot sauce and then now we have uh, the, the sauce. sauce um Tell me what your dad thought about this. Cause he, he, he really liked it because <laughs> it, um, it rolled really good off his hand yep. and rolled up, and it's like smooth in the mid lane but overall strong. Yeah. So you can get a little bit inside. You can see he's playing a little bit deeper than straight up 10 mm -hmm. and letting it roll out and then whoosh, back into the bucket. Yeah, no, I, when I drilled this, I wasn't sure how your dad would react to yeah. throwing it because it's a very strong cover. Yes. Um, but his... You know, his natural tendencies are going to lend themselves to an, more of an asymmetric ball. Yes, yeah. So when I saw him really like it, yeah, I was like, oh, boy. Yeah. There's going to be a fight over this ball. <laughs> it, there's one weird thing about this. I don't know if it's because of the way they modified it. Or if you just watch a couple of my shots, mm -hmm. I've kept it in oil. She goes down. She makes the turn. Mm -hmm. And it was a soft turn. And just kind of settles in there. Now I get a little bit wider. Boom. It's almost like because they're riding that that line that it if you get it in deep, it almost can start acting similar to symmetric. A little bit more continuous through well, the What is symmetric? Down. I mean um asymmetric. asymmetric yes. Yeah. Where if you get it wide and let it run, oh it's a symmetric. You can see it. It's just Yeah, for, for yeah. being the match player, this ball is very strong for yeah. you. Um this could almost be into the into the a heavy Ooh. control slot. Yeah. I would probably take a little surface off, make it like a medium control. Yeah. But this is like a benchmark ball oh, for yeah. you. Yeah, I've been I've been throwing it, and I've been taking it out of my bag first to see what if I have to go up to like a, a statement solid yep. or a pearl statement pearl or something yep. like that. It just gives me a good read because it's got such nice smooth motion yes. that it's very. Um, forgiving and a I'm able to decide where I want to go with it. Well, and that's what you want out of a benchmark ball. Yeah. You want a ball that you can make some mistakes with. Yeah. Um that's going to get back. Yeah. And has some playability, some versatility. Yeah. Well, and that's I, the thing. I, yeah. You, you hit it right on uh, the the nail Ooh. on the head. You played it out, you were able to play it in. That's yeah. a mark of versatility. Well, yeah. And that's the thing. It's like you said, we haven't adjusted the cover. Yeah, we haven't touched the, the cover. cover. No. So, I mean, there's oh, here's Cam. room up and down. So so very quickly, it became a three-way fight for this ball. <laughs> yeah. Um, and while Scoops and Pooks won, um, Cam made himself a very good case for it because, uh, well, you can see this ball as a 
benchmark ball well, yeah. allows him to play really nice, really yeah. free. Let her get out there. Let her run. You can see he's playing. Just watch it get out. Yeah, that he, one's in now. See, he's and this played, is what I'm talking about. He's played you outside got, yeah, the oil pattern. Yeah. He's gotten in. And, yeah, and the ball continues. Yeah. Now we went with a little bit of a longer pin because you guys have more tilt than I do. Yes. So we could increase the pin to pap distance allowing it to be a little more continuous for you guys styles yeah. and you can see it across the board oh, here yeah. there's a huge difference for sure you can just watch just watch it come up look at it look it's like no it's not gonna yeah. hit oh yeah. Ooh. <laughs> yeah, shake it off so for you for you players who have tilt don't yeah. be afraid of those four and a half inch pins no no um because that is going to be your most versatile pin placement. Oh, for sure. In that four and, four and a quarter to four and a half. As your tilt gets higher, as your tilt gets lower, as your rotation gets, it's going to change. But for the most part. Yeah. You can just watch. watch. Okay, this one's a little bit wider. You can see it come off the pattern. Boom. Blew those pins back. Yeah. Just. I was going to say, I'm glad I won the fight for this one. <laughs> no, it's been a great ball. And like I said, I can get in, get away from the edge. Whew. That's some hot sauce. Regular sauce. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe and turn on notifications so you never miss a show. So until next time, guys, we'll see you lane side.